Okay, we are back, and it's been uh, it's been an interesting go. I'm not gonna lie. Um, basically, what happened here before we even get started? I'm using an emulator and on a really old PC as well, uh, or laptop, whatever. And it's been it's been rough. <laughs> basically, the file got deleted. So, I'm trying to figure out how to just save files right actually to the desktop. And even that's kind of messed up. I don't know. Look, maybe I don't know enough when it comes to this. But anyway, what I did is I started back beginning of Lin's Quest because I didn't ha even have the option to start again at Elwood's because my computer is picking this up as if it's the first time I've played the game, right? So played back through. I actually think it went better. I tried to even out a few units. So um, we've got a couple that are going to be showing up uh, as level 10s now, which... I'm actually quite stoked about so this should be good you know I think going back and redoing it was positive because we're actually putting a little bit of a better spot than we were now so I like that but I hope it doesn't happen again because I don't want to grind out you know more than 12 chapters next time 12 chapters was fine it's a lot of other videos we're trying to do right now so um, as much as I love the game ideally that doesn't happen Master of Fidel, what is the meaning of this? Peace, Lord Hellman. Whatever is wrong. You said you were just going to frighten Elwood. Your men almost killed him. My patience is at its end. I've decided I must tell Elwood everything and apologize. You would betray us. I'm tired of you and the Black Fang. Now, remove yourself from my castle. Your presence pains me. Lord Hellman, is there nothing I can do to change your mind? Nothing. In that case, you're no longer of any use. What? Uh, uh, uh. That's good. There's the castle, Elwood. We have to speak with Lord Hellman. <laughs> That's not gonna happen, laddie. Who are you? Who am I? Ha, boy. You do better to worry about yourself. You'll be worm's meat before much longer. You think so? I think my axe will change your mind. Ha! The cub thinks he's a wolf. Does your bite match your bark? Tell you what. If you make it to the castle alive, we'll find out, eh? <laughs> well... He's a threat. He does look like a threat. He doesn't know that um, our boy Hector has that wolf beal, though. Can be effective against him. Hey, you. Yeah, the new dog. Get this right or you're gone. I know, I know. I just got this job. I don't want to lose it. Of course, the smart thing to do would have been to not get involved with this ugly bunch. Gotta have gold if I want to eat, though. I was too picky before. If I think about the time I passed out in Kalian, ooh, nothing funny about that. That man, what's his name? Matthew? If it hadn't been for him, I would have starved to death. What are you mumbling about? Get over here now! Yes, yes, I'm coming. At least I've got work. Oh, we got loaded. Oh, sorry about that. Yawning. A lot of, uh, yeah, short nights. Okay, nice to be working with you, Abe. As a journeyman knight of fairy, I'm here to serve Lord Elwood and you, Abe. I await your command. That's really nice. I don't know why he's deciding to talk to us now. I feel like we've been hanging out for a little while. He's been with us, but... You know, I guess here he is, and, and now he wants to talk, so I respect that. Kind of. And he gets to fight for that, you know? I like these Cavaliers. Might be boring for you guys, though, if, if we just... If we have three Paladins eventually. 
I mean, plus Marcus. Oof. I don't know. We'll figure it out. We'll figure it out. I want to find a low skill unit to use this uh, book on. Increase the skill by two points. Let's see. Wow. Okay, he's got that skill. I don't care about Rebecca. Not. I don't really. It's not that I don't care about Bartree. I don't have time to care about Bartree. <sighs> Hector, we're gonna need Hector, so that's gotta be better. Oswin, I really like, but I don't, I don't think we can really afford it. Think about all the Cavaliers we have. If you haven't played this game, a Knight's Crest is what's going to level up a Cavalier uh, into a Paladin, but it's also what turns a Knight into a General. So you kind of end up in an issue if you want to turn a bunch of Cavaliers into Paladins. You also want to turn Knights into Generals at the same time. It just gets messed up because they max out at 20. Uh, and then you can promote them with the Knight's Crest and, and continue on to level 20 again. And when you have people sitting stagnant at level 20, it really sucks because it's a unit you want to use. And I would say that you can't actually use that unit because you don't want to waste the XP. So... Anyway, pretty clearly, so far, I mean, Matthew's not really going to be someone who uses a bunch. So, I think it'll go to, uh, to our boy Hector here. He'll use that and he'll be happy about it. Or else, we'll get some guys over here to take care of this just a couple of units big old team we're gonna have to we're gonna have to cut it down oh so this is your your opportunity to see uh, the new team I guess or a little bit of it I haven't got to show you. I put a bit more work into Dorcas. And I said I didn't just want to grind out in front of you guys. Yeah, that sounds a little weird. Um, <laughs> but on camera, uh, because it would just feel like it's a waste of a lot of your time, right? So uh, since I had to go back, I did kind of grind Sarah a little bit. I got her up to like level 12. So it was a lot of just like. You know, taking advantage of healing her on every single turn, and when I got to the final boss, Lugrid, I did kind of just like let people take damage and heal with her for a while. Not trying to be too cheap with it, but I do like that she's a lot more useful now. All right, let's make Dorcas useful. Why did I even bring Rebecca in the battle? Get out of here. You are not wanted. Sorry. Good stuff. Nice. I want to get a hero's crest soon for uh, for Dorcas. That'd be cool. We need to get Elwood up, but no one needs the work more than Hector. Hector, pretty much, he's the the guy that I want to put the effort into right now. Perfect. And I'll we'll keep this going. Low in. I don't mind getting low in some XP. Okay, so you saw that conversation with Guy earlier. This guy over here named Guy. Another Sakian. So we gotta have him on our team. And oh, okay, never mind. You know what? You, you have seen already with Dork Dorcas how you can um Maybe we'll start calling him that from now on. If he's not being good to us. Anyway, you can recruit an enemy unit, right? So you've seen that. So he referenced Matthew. It's pretty on the nose generally. You can you can tell what unit you're gonna want to talk to him with, uh, based off of who they reference just before the battle. OK, 
Okay. Let's get these guys ready. We should give something else to this guy. Maybe Steel Axe, just so he's not constantly using the, uh, the other. Who has... He's gonna have good strength. Who has bad strength? I said good strength. Bad strength, but I don't really care that much. Elwood. Hmm. Elwood, actually. Okay. Okay. Here we go. This is going to be good. This is going to get us a bonus chapter. And you want the bonus chapters, trust me. One, because you get good items. Two, we need that sweet, sweet XP. And I think I've already said that before in one of the other videos, but truly we do. Hmm. Question is, how are we going to approach this? Ah, what good timing. Would you try this for me? It's an invention of a great witch. Me. It's a mine. It contains some very explosive magic. Hide it on the ground when an enemy steps on it. Kaboom! <laughs> I'm still testing them, so that one's free. Come back and tell me how it works. Awesome. So I don't know for sure if I can do it with the emulator here. But the cool thing about these mines... Oh, again. Oh, freak guys, I'm sorry. The really cool thing about these mines, and actually this is getting me hyped up, is, sure, whatever, it's going to do a little bit of damage. It does, like, honestly, like 10, 15 damage. Pretty in inconsequential, especially, like, long term. But this is actually one of the most useful uh, items in the entire game, because there was a hack back on Game Boy Advance that used to always use. You set a mine... And as soon as one of the enemy units steps on it, you immediately turn off the game and you turn it back on again. And uh, all of a sudden you will have access to the rest of that enemy phase. So at that point, I just have all the enemies start dropping their weapons. And it's a fantastic way to uh, get some good XP. So I love that. We might not really do that unless you guys are asking for it. I'll, I'll try and find a way to make it happen, but I just don't know if it's going to work the same way with the emulator. Anyway, uh, absolute lifesaver in the other game. Let's continue on. Let's see. So long as guy's out of range, I am good. We'll fight any of these guys, but we will not... We don't want to fight... Um, guy... We don't want that smoke. He's not even that good, but we don't want the smoke. Good. He's already a beast. Yeah, Hector starts off pretty good right from the get-go. Hmm. Don't love that. I don't even know that that necessarily made sense. Okay. Okay. Now it's on. approach this actually that's an interesting kind of question I guess I could do this to take care of him and still be out of range thank you uh, oh, stupid good can Sarah survive a little bit of an onslaught that's the question it's a good question. I 
don't know that I have the answer to it. Here's how we'll draw. We'll draw a guy out by killing this guy. We'll draw a guy out by killing this guy. Sweet. And then what we'll do, this is the sneaky sneaky. We take the weapons. Give me your weapons. Because he'll kill Guy, for sure. Um, if Guy comes up against him, he's just going to end up killing him. He's too powerful. I don't even know that I want to even use Guy. That's beside the point. I think she can survive it. She's pretty good. These guys are like level 2. But it's a lot of damage she's gonna take. Oh. Let's go, please don't hit, please don't hit. There we go. Taking so many risks early on. And this here to secure the bonus chapter. This will never do! Look at the time! I must leave for Kalian now, or my business will be ruined. Time is money after all. Hurry, hurry, rush, rush, rush. Huh, what's this? That man must have dropped it. A torch, there we go. Exactly what we're looking for. Just get Matthew ready to kind of jump in at any old time here. He's gonna have to carry us a bit. The fact that he can actually do that to Marcus is impressive. 27% chance of critical is like no joke. Yeah, I knew these guys were there. Unfortunately, oh yeah. I love the crit animations. Hmm. Okay, that's what I was hoping for, yeah. He's weak. I really wasn't going to put work into healers, but just kind of naturally now that's not going to be too hard, which makes me happy. Who knows? Maybe we'll give her a promotion at some point. That would be actually kind of cool. Hmm. Get Marcus out of the way. Unfortunately, this this might be a risk. We're gonna see how this goes. Talk. Hold on. I know you. Isn't your name Guy? It's is that you, Matthew? <laughs> what a pleasant surprise. Has your sword work coming? You are aware this isn't the best place to catch up, aren't you? You and I were on opposite sides. What? Are you saying you're gonna fight me? I, well, yeah, I've mu I'm much improved. You can't best me. You're quite a terror guy. Well then, hold on. I think I'd prefer it if you repaid what you owe me. Huh? Last time I saw you, I gave you food. If I remember correctly, you said you owed me your life. I only said that because you said you'd feed me if I did. I hadn't eaten in 10 days and you were cooking meat. You, this, this isn't fair. People of Saki never lie. Isn't that right, guy? Ugh, fine. I finally find work and now I have to throw it away. This is all your fault. It is. Nice, we get to see that critical right away. Let's go with Hector. Wow. Hector, man. You gotta finish the job. There we go. Dorcas is our guy. It's hard to even get him one level, though, when he's this leveled up. What? Hmm. 
Hmm. Maybe a lamp. Okay. This should do it. If we hit. Oh my goodness, these archers. These freaking archers are annoying me so much. Oh, that's okay. All right. Feeling better about that one. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Done. I gotta stop using the rapier. We need, 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 need another sword for him. It's like, it's not even that the rapier is amazing, but it's just these, these special weapons that are really meant just for, you know, yeah, sword level PRF preference, I guess, or perfect. I don't know. Um, are just for certain classes. So it's really just for Elwood. So because of that, I don't want to just waste it like it's any old sword. Uh, maybe these guys will take a little XP too. Yeah, why not? They should not have a problem with that. Okay, who's gonna be taking this? Let's do. Yeah, Elwood. We gotta decide if we're using Guy or not. You know what? We don't get a lot of comments in these videos. Everybody is all about the Fire, em fire Emblem Engage videos. And uh, not a lot of comments in the. Um, Farm Emblem 7 videos, so you know what? I gotta say, Devin, I saw you in the comments. I appreciate you watching all these videos and just how positive you are. And it gets me fired up because in some ways I actually prefer these like older ones just from the nostalgia factor. So the fact that you're watching, the fact that you're enjoying, gets me fired up, man. I have to say that. Um, and maybe there's a couple others of you that just aren't commenting. I'm fired up that you guys are here. I, I like I like some of the older stuff. Um, anyway, so I'm asking you specifically, because I saw you in the comments. Do you want us to use Guy or not? You know, should we should we level this guy up? I don't know. Seven is a significant amount of damage here. Mm. That's an issue. This better hit. There we go. I wouldn't have expected Lowen was going to be um, on the roster of people I was giving experience to, so maybe we'll take him back, but I mean, he actually was pretty impressive there, so. I'm happy with that. All right. Let's see here. Look at them running away from this. That makes me happy. There's something about Dorcas's luck that just kills me. Man, holy. Holy. Fast forward enough. We said we would, remember? All right. There we go. Oh yeah. Ooh, 40 HP. Oh, 39. That you had. Okay. Fair enough. Still pretty epic. All right. What, what's he at? Seven? Ooh. Okay, yeah, it's got to be Hector. Unfortunately, it's got to be Hector. That's not even that fun to see at this point, but it has to be. Wow, Dorcas. You're still a beast. Thank goodness you have so much health and you're a beast. Because that is just... It's just sad to see 
get hit in the 40s. What is that, like five times in a row? Mind blowing. How's this guy doing? Oh, we're gonna take him out with Dorcas. Hopefully. The weapon triangle has such a crazy effect, eh? Look at that. 50%. 50%. And he's. What are you? Level 12 versus a level 2. And I have a 50% chance to hit. Come on. Alright, bud. Hey, there you go. Perfect. There it is. Okay, so let's make sure we've taken advantage of healing everyone with Sarah. Uh, we'll bring Sarah up. Now. What the? Oh, yeah, yeah okay. Lowen needs little health. We want it, like I said, we want to use her for every turn we can. We really want. We want that Sarah XP, too. She just needs to survive, guys. <laughs> I don't really want anything from her besides that. Just live. Okay, what's this guy got? He's got a steel lance. So he's just going to have to get, you know, harassed by Dorcas because that's the way it's going to be. What's this? You've made it this far? Ah, I paid too much for that worthless pack of cell swords. Wow, Dorcas, man. I mean, wow. That's okay. Oh, effective against you, my friend. Let's go. Come on out. We're here. Well, well, well. You survived, I see. You'll find that I'm a bit tougher than those fools you faced before. What have you done with Marquis Santaraz? You want to know? You'll have to best me first. All right. Okay. Really, he's, he's not that tough. I like that. Take all the XP you can. Take all the XP you can. Oh, heal Dorcas. Okay, this should be basically last turn if he hits. That was a good map. Dorcas and Sarah, I mean, see, our team from Lin's Quest is already like MVPs, and I like that. 77, we got him. Nice. You've beaten me, but you're too late to save him. Too, too bad, eh, laddie? <laughs> That's what's up. Mm, okay. Okay. I feel like one thing I really want to see from him is uh, HP. Oh, that is a. Why did you have to play me like that? We need the support. We need the support between these two. Ah, Elwood. It's good to see you're still well. Hmm. You expected otherwise? No, of course not. I need to be fine. Hector, wait for a moment. What did you want? Nothing. It's enough to see that you that you live and are still fighting. Just wanted to make sure you weren't overdoing it with me not around. I should say the same to you. Me? Don't worry about me. I'm fine. I'm built tough, you know. I'm a little too a little too much is just enough for me. But you? You've never been a hardy one, Elwood. Nor are you used to travel. Go on too long and you'll collapse. We're all weaklings compared to you, Hector. Thankfully, wars are not won by strength alone, eh? We've been sparring once every two months since we were 12. And of 30 matches, 14 I won, 12 I lost, and 4 were draws. Er, I think not. I recall 31 matches, an even 13-13 split with 5 draws. Yes, well, you recall wrong. I'm in the right. Hmm, oh. Whose snoring was it that shook the rafters in numbers class? Ah, good point. Still, I'm touched you were worried about me. Now, back to the fray. Hey, wait! Blast. Oh, no, 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 no. Not until we get that healing in. 
Yeah, she's good. Okay. Lord Hellman! Is that you, Elwood? Hold on, my lord. I... I must apologize. Your father, he... Do you know something, sir? Uh, if I hadn't told Elbert about Darren's plans, this would never have... <coughs> Lord Hellman! Go to Loss. Darren, the Marquis of Loss, knows all. Marquis Loss? I'm sorry, El I, I can't. Hold on! Beware the black fang. Lord Hellman! He's gone. Can't be. Lord Hellman. Why? Why did this happen? Plus, what is going on? We go to loss. We must speak to the Marquis of Lost, Lord Darren. You're right. We should leave quickly. I'm not sure how far we can get today, but I can see I can't sit still. Pardon me. Hmm? If I may. Who are you? I'm the steward of Santa Rose. With our lord gone, what are we to do? First you give Lord Helmut a proper burial. After that, I'm sure the Lycian Council will have to meet. Stay here and defend the castle until you hear more. I understand. Let's go. We must keep moving. Yes. Now we seek answers from Marquis Santaraz too. Lord Hellman, may you find peace. Accept side quests always. And at this point, we'll save. Hopefully, we don't run into any more issues like last time. Anyway. Love you guys. Thank you for watching. You are awesome. And I am out for the day. Have a great one. Bye.